apparently you have survived to episode 5 of our spooktacular Yuan the Grudge playthrough. It is Saran and Hina if you haven't figured it out already, or if you just skipped to this episode. Because this is the best episode as far as I'm concerned. We're heading to the cursed house. Yes. So, spoiler alert, if you haven't put it together, which you kind of could have, but kind of not, these, this is all one family. Erica was the start chasing her dog, she's a daughter. Uh, she has her brother, who's the delivery boy, it was Ken. Mickey was the mother in the hospital, and uh, Hero was the dad, who was working as security guard. And now we're back to Erica, who somehow survived, not that we know how, with her dog thing, and is going home to the cursed house. This is why you don't move in the cursed house. Okay. Okay. No. This is really dark. Ah, yes. Oh, oh. no. But yeah, you could have figured out that it was all one family before this because you had to be picking up uh, pictures and stuff and it kind of like hinted at it in very subtle ways. Also, this is the hardest one that you have to unlock. You don't just get this episode. You have to find all the little pamphlets and stuff from the previous ones. That was the toilet. Yeah. Uh, across the street. <laughs> across the way! And that references your brother's delivery box thing. And this whole episode, it, it references the previous ones too, to a degree. Kind of neat. But yeah, this is the hardest episode. The battery wears out the fastest, and you only get two this whole time, so you can't dilly daddy shilly shally. Haha. <laughs> uh -huh. Proverbial Zelda hand in the toilet. There you go, Kara. Try and take a bath in that. <laughs> so clean. <laughs> I don't think that was clean. No, but that's all Kara wants to be. Look at the phone. good at creaky kind of steps too. But I don't have a cat. I have a dog. No. She probably kind of knows what's coming. I mean she just went through the stuff in the abandoned house uh, or abandoned warehouse and now it's all like this. Oof, I don't like that scratchy noise. Look at that. It's almost as bad as nails on chalkboard. Damn cat! Yeah, you couldn't see that probably because it's very dark, but there's yeah, actually cat and kid. All the drawings. I took a key. in the house actually lock with a key. Kitties. Oh, the kitties! No! All the babies. No, kitty! Yeah. Go downstairs and unlock that door. I 
Get the god dang phone. No, I'm gonna let it ring forever. No. <laughs> Wait, number 989 to drive Seren nuts. Freaking, uh, letting things ring and beep and whatever the heck forever. Oh, so messy. I blame Kara. Hi! Onichan! Doshite! the crossover in the other room that way. These doors are also a bit of a pain to open. There we go. Yeah, get it like just right. God damn kid. Stop kneading kneading your knees. You okay? Do I look okay? <laughs> I want a cookie. Okay, let's try to go through the door again. Flashing in this one. I think we're just going to the kitchen there. Oh, the kitchen's where the other battery was. What? That's you. I don't remember her being so bloody. enough courage to do like a voiceover thing kind of like Ev and I, I I wasn't very good at that but one day I'll do it like all in Japanese it'll be awesome I like how I sound better in Japanese than in English hey. man I remember this level better than any other level here Except for the battery, you thought it was in the kitchen. Yeah, I thought the, no, I thought the battery was in the kids' room, not the kitchen. I think we'll speak it with K. Meh. Meh. <laughs> Close enough. I keep, like, I'm realizing that I'm starting to confuse this game partially with the calling because that's very similar aspects. Hi, kid. Weird, that kid's like always naked. He's got underwear on. No, but it's still kind of weird. It has like no clothes on that. Oh, the toilet! It's always nice to have multiple bathrooms in your house. We got a little laundry room. Nothing in it, but that's okay. And then there's that room.
everybody dead. Why? <laughs> I hear you. You do so good at voiceovers compared to me. Even girl ones. I don't know if that's a compliment. Yeah, kind of, I guess. You just gonna act it? Their phones are upstairs in that very creepy little bag thing. Oh boy. For all those that know, the attic is very, very bad in the Yuan series. Very bad. No. Their bags are in the well, Wait, their bodies are in the bags. <laughs> She stripped us on the way, which is kind of funny. You can see no good comes from a horror ending, for the most part. Well, we hope you enjoyed it. I always enjoy watching these, you know, I don't know if I drag them into playing. But, you know, what are you thinking of? I didn't get that phone call. <laughs> There's anything at the end of the credits out there. There's Hirotomi Imoto. You can see all the people in their hard How work. Can forget I forgot about them Hirotomi already. <laughs> uh, Ray. Just a heads up, if you actually do want to find this game, good luck. It was a pain in the butt because 
they really didn't release a lot of these. It took me a while to get it. Originally, I rented it and was like, wow, this is an awesome game. I want to buy it. And I couldn't find any local game stores, so I had to get it online. However, our rental basically said, no, you can't keep it. It's kind of our only one. Yeah, which is kind of funny. So, we did a hunt on the game, trying to find where we could buy it. Eventually, we found it. Bought it right away. Yeah. I think the cheapest I got it was either 40 or 30 bucks or something. Wow, this is a pretty good game. Yeah, it's, a, it's an older game, but it's still like really good. I We've replayed it a couple times. I mean, you know the story, but it's just fun to go back to. And if you want to with like friends doing the courage level, it's just fun in theory. <laughs> friends are gamers, I guess. I believe also in the courage level, or even throughout the, the whole story, I think. You could actually play a second player, which can randomly generate yeah. a pop-up scare for the first play. Yeah. They're not exactly like really, really good like the story mode pop-up scares, but they weren't bad. I mean, it's just fun. It's a shame. A lot of the Xseed games that they like make a lot of effort to bring over here, they bring over a lot of Japanese games and translate them. And they go under the radar, like Corpse Party went under the radar, and I adore that game. You do love the Corpse Party. I do. If I could figure out a way to cast that, I would. Anything else? Anything else going, going on? Yay, look how brave you are! That was more of a sissy. Well, you were really brave. You got a high bravo meter. Scare level, you know. How mm -hmm. is it? <laughs> okay, well, we hope you enjoyed this. Um, if we can do more mini series, I would like to. I hope you guys will like, comment, subscribe, and check out the other videos and let us know. If you have any other suggestions, we can try to hit them up as best we can. Please leave them in the comments if you have anything in mind. If we can actually grab it. Yeah. We'll still try. To a degree. Don't ask for like things like Barbie. Please, we're, we're not going to do that. Oh, don't tell me about your Feel Plus. <laughs> feel Plus. <laughs> okay. But anyway, like, comment, subscribe, check out our videos on the channel, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.